What is up guys and welcome back to the John Q channel. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, and when I uploaded a few videos, I realized that the comments on those videos were disabled. The reason for that being apparently there was a big ring of some pedophiles that were caught on YouTube. Either way, some bad stuff was happening on YouTube and so now YouTube has created some guidelines for small, medium, and large creators like you and me so you know to protect kids and protect younger the the younger audience of YouTube. And this is and this is hard for me to like actually put out there because I feel like it's going around the guidelines. But again, it's it really isn't because I'm not putting out any harmful content, and I'm sure you guys aren't either. And you just want to upload your videos without getting your comments disabled. I'm going to show you a quick workaround. The, the uploading on the new YouTube studio versus the classic. And that's really the answer to all of this. To have your comments enabled and not disabled, you have to upload to classic. So to do that, you do this. You go to YouTube, you go top right corner, create a video or a post. You click on that, you go to upload a video. And then this window will pop up. You know, this is the new uh, YouTube studio. But if you're gonna want to get around the disabled comments, and enable your comments, click on Upload with Classic. I don't do any of these boxes. I choose not to and I go to Other and I don't tell them why. It's, it, it won't penalize you, so don't worry. You're not gonna get in trouble. It's just that's what I do and I, I choose not to. So, and so you can see up here, you are legally required to comply with Children's Online Privacy Protection Act and or other laws required to tell us if your videos are made for kids. Use a new upload tool for that. What I don't like about this workaround is that you can't really put on cards or you know end screens. And you can once you upload through here and your comments will be enabled, but then you have to go to the new YouTube studio. Then you have to work around and actually put in your end screens and, and your cards. So you can do that, but then you have to click made for kids. And I'm not sure if that will disable your comments. I haven't tried it, but I just know so far it's been working for me. So again, you want to just, I'll do an example here. Upload your video just as you would in the new YouTube. Upload a screen, go as before. This is the old, again, this is the old kind of version of this. You go to your title, your description, your tags, and then you literally just hit publish. That's all it really takes. And so, like I said, if you wanted that workaround, it's there for you. And, you know, it's frustrating because the, the comments, and, and I'll tell you this, it's frustrating because the comment section is very important for me. S you know, a small, relatively small creator uh, on YouTube, I want to be able to connect with my community, with my audience, you know, to make those connections, to reply, to answer questions, to get people to comment down below on my videos so I can interact with them. That's some of the most important stuff on YouTube. That's why I joined YouTube. So, like I said, that's a workaround. I hope you found this video helpful and I hope you found it informative. Again, please, I cannot stress enough, comply with YouTube regulations, conditions, guidelines, anything that YouTube says to do, you should adhere to it because it's important. They have set those rules to protect us and the younger audience, so let's do so. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I will catch you next time on the Johnny Q channel. Peace.